Ben and Samaya, it really just has been the best week and such a great week to be from Connecticut where everyone celebrates the Huskies. That parade does kick off tomorrow morning in front of the state capitol at Trinity and Elm Streets where I'm standing now. They'll go under the arch behind me and make their way in front of the XL Center where there's going to be a rally. Several of the players are set to speak, including Andre Jackson. Today, earlier today, some fans got the chance to meet him as they continue to keep the celebration going. In Connecticut, many people come from long lines of Husky fans. My whole family went to UConn, so we've been UConn fans for 50 years. <laughs> long time. It's in their blood to bleed blue. Oh, very much a family affair. A family affair passed on for generations. From Connecticut and grew up watching them. Jamie Cody of Manchester is a lifelong UConn fan. And now her son, Paul, is two. I thought they were probably, probably going to win ever since they started. Born in 2014, the last time the men won a championship, and cheering them on ever since. It's, it's something that we get to do together. The Cody's were among those who lined up at Dick's Sporting Goods in Manchester to meet one of UConn's best, Andre Jackson Jr. It's awesome to just see all the support and everybody that was had our backs, you know what I mean, the whole time we were there playing the tournament. As people watch them play, they notice something special. This whole group is different than some of the other teams in the past, that these guys all work together. It's almost like one big family. Yeah, definitely. We're a family, and that's kind of what we stress was just our culture and, and just relying on one another out there on the court. Family, just like the one fans watch the games with. The games together was really fun. Great experience. And on Saturday, all of Connecticut will join together as one big family to celebrate a spectacular win. It's bringing an entire state together to have a parade because like after the championship game at like stores like all the students were all together but this is going to be like a moment for the entire state to come together. We have much more information on the parade including the routes and any parking things that you need to know about that's up on our website fox61.com. Reporting live in Hartford, Gabby Molina, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.